an Omaha mother is accused of not only looking the other way, but failing to alert police when a sex crime was taking place under her own roof involving her children. Investigators believe the motive might have been money. Senior reporter Jake Wisikowski has the alarming details. It's at this Midtown apartment complex where a 31 year old mother is accused of knowing one of her children sexually assaulted his siblings and doing nothing about it. We're not identifying the woman to protect her children, but she is charged with two counts of felony child abuse. Police say the woman's 12 year old son sexually assaulted his younger sisters and four year old brother. The mother never reported the abuse, but a former friend, Latasha Collier, who spent a lot of time with the kids, called CPS. And I felt like those kids needed me. The mother apparently told Collier that she wouldn't call Child Protective Services because she didn't want to lose a monthly disability check she received for the 12-year-old that was committing the acts. But when you let your, your son do this to your youngest children and you blame it on not having a check, like you deserve not to ever, ever even be close to a little kid again. The children were taken to Project Harmony. They told investigators the mother knew about the touching, but she would say, whatever goes in my house stays in my house. Court documents reveal that 12-year-old previously abused his sisters. The children are now in DHS custody. Jean Klein with Project Harmony can't speak specifically about the case, but says an estimated 70 percent of child sex abuse people see goes unreported. And it just means we have to do even more work around making sure people know when to report it and how to report child abuse. Uh, and then whether the consequences of not reporting abuse or neglect, it's, it can be pretty devastating to a child to try to tell someone what was going on and then there's no action. The mother was released from jail on her own recognizance. She wasn't home when we tried to speak with her. If convicted, she faces up to 10 years in prison. Jake Wozikowski, KMTV Action 3 News. And the mother has been ordered not to visit her children. If you suspect child abuse, call the Abuse Neglect Hotline. We have that information at our website, kmtv.com.